Hey guys, Hi Rider 121 here, and welcome, finally, <laughs> after such a long time, the first Let's Play. Now, I'm going to be doing one, at least one of my favorite games ever. Like, this is, I've, this is probably also one of the first games I've ever played in my life. So, yeah. This is Crash Bandicoot 1. This, this I believe this game was made in like 1996, but yeah, um, yeah, Crash Bandicoot. This this is definitely an amazing game, and you should get, definitely go out and buy it. I just I I got it, I got it because I had it. I read. Oh man, I can't even speak. I had a copy way before this when I was really little, but that copy is scratched, and I had to go get a new one, so here it is. I'll just wait for the, uh, the intro sequence. Here it goes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'll shut up and wait for the end. But Dr. Intro. Cortex, we have not determined the cause of past failures. Tomorrow, <laughs> this bandicoot will be my general, and he will lead my Cortex commandos to world domination. This time I shall reign triumphant. We are closer than ever before. Quickly, into the vortex. But Dr. Cortex, the vortex is not ready. We have no idea what it could do. <laughs> Failure again. Capture him. Uh-oh. Prepare the female band. All right. In case your observational skills are... Not smart. Uh, basically, what just happened was Cortex, that the main antagonist, his plan was to create a gigantic army, and Crash, the main protagonist, was supposed to be the commander, and that big machine he was gonna put him in was, you know, gonna advance the process along, but it it failed, you know, and Crash is a rogue experiment. So he, you know, he jumped out the window, and they're like, "Prepare the female Bandicoot," which is her name is Tana, and that's Crash's love interest. So now Crash is going on an amazing quest to go save his girl, his girl, and that quest starts here, in Sanity Beach. So yeah. Like I said, this game was made in, like, 1996, so don't judge it by its graphics and, you know, its appearance. Judge it by its content. And I, I assure you, its content is amazing. This game has had me invested in just loving to play this for hours, man. But at the same time, this game could be very rage-inducing when the levels get harder. And you'll, you'll notice, because I'll start yelling more, I'll get angry, and I'll start raging. But that's not going to come for a while, so... Yeah, you're not going to have to listen to my annoying voice scream for not at least 20, maybe 15 more levels. Which is good, because uh, it can, I can just... It'll be like this for hours sometimes. But yeah, I mean... These first couple levels are fairly easy. I usually don't, you know, I don't mess up as much. I mean, there's still a chance that I might, but, you know, whatever. Yeah. Invincibility time. If you get three Aku Aku masks, you get to be invincible for a short period in time. Which is awesome. Which means, if I do this quick enough, I can do this. Walk right across. Did I do it? Did I? Oh, I missed one. There we go. Okay. Sometimes I don't do that correctly. I ain't gonna go there yet. Give me a second. Alright. Yeah, this is just the first level. Fairly easy. Fairly easy. I mean, it wasn't easy when I was little, because I used to get stuck on this stuff all the time. But now that I have all grown up and awesome... I can do this, you know, without any sweat. First gem. Now, like, uh, I'm doing a 100% playthrough of this. And, um, in order to get 100%, you have to get one of the 
ev you have to get all the gems. You have to get all of the gems in every single level, everywhere. Um, and in, in order to get the gem, you have to get through every single level without missing a single box or dying once. So, I got my gem. So, I, I might as well just do the second level while I'm at it. Because I do have enough time, I'm only five minutes in. So, Jungle Rollers. Next level. Oh, yeah. Now, like, another thing I love about this game is that, I mean, the graphics aren't, like, amazing, like, updated. It's like, this is nothing compared, like, to the graphics in PS4 games or whatever, Xbox One, whatever you prefer, but... But I just love the, uh... The scenery, all the plants, you know, the animals, all, you know, the surround. Oh, shoot. No! Oh, well. The, you know, look at, look at all this plant life and everything. It looks so pretty. It's, it's visual, it's, it's visually, aesthetically pleasing to the eye. Which is good. If you wanna, where? I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, okay. It's one- Oh, I'm stuck again! Where? Oh. It's one thing- Oh! Oh, no, whatever. One thing you want in a game, you want to get somebody- You want to get somebody's attention, you want to make it look good. You know, if you see a, you know, poorly drawn, or poorly animated, whatever, you're gonna, you know... You subcon- Oh, shoot. I used to get stuck on this part all the time. Cause you have to get the life in the middle without blowing yourself up with the TNT. Like that. Oh no! Why did I do that? I just... Oh. At least I got the life. What is going on? I am messing up left and right. I should probably pay attention a little bit more. And not talk so much. Me and my big mouth. Alright, you see those three faces, you get, you collect three of these to uh, advance to the bonus round, which I'm doing right now. Yeah. See, look how, look how pretty that is, all the trees in the back. It's really nice, it's a lot of, uh, scenery. I mean, granted that it is, like, you know, a lot of that, a lot of those trees are, like, 2D, you can't see, like, all sides of it, but from the direction that you are looking, it looks pretty awesome. Yeah. Let me save this real quick. 3% complete. I don't... Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to get the gem on this. Not that I... I don't think... Yeah, you're not... I'm not gonna be able to get the gem on this, because... Um, certain levels require... Um, other gems from other levels to find secret paths or secret boxes that aren't visible when you just run through it normally. So I'll have to come back to this level in a later level, a later episode, and do it again, and not die, and get all the boxes, the ones included. See, I missed three boxes on the secret path. So, yeah. I believe I need the green gem, which I do not have. But I will have. So that and that wraps, about, uh, wraps it up for this video. Uh, this is High Rider 121, and I will see y'all next time. Peace.